What's up guys, my name is Zanan and as you can see the video and the audio quality is really bad. I did a lot of mistakes, for example the ISO is really high, the aperture is way too close, the white balance is bad and I'm using only the room's lights. The audio is bad because I use a built-in microphone and almost all of the cameras has a really bad uh, built-in microphone so this is why the audio is sounds this. And in this video I want to show you how to make uh, from this video to this. So the first step that you should do is buy a cheap microphone. I use a Tashcam DR05, which is not too expensive, but this is not the cheapest microphone that you can buy. You should set the input level really low, so it's going to be sounds like a studio microphone. Okay, I've just set it the microphone. The second thing that you should do is set your camera. Set your aperture to the biggest that you can. On this uh, lens it's going to be 1.7. Uh, I set the ISO to the lowest. And after that you will see it's a lot better. So as you can see the background is uh, blurred a little but my face is sharp. And as you can see my face is really uh, yellow and the background is really yellow because you didn't set the white balance. On most of the cameras you can set the white balance really easily, you just need something which is white and you should take a photo of it and the camera set the white balance really good. As you can see, the white balance is good now. My face and the background is not yellow. This is the correct color. The last thing that you should do is buy some lights. Uh, turn off your room lights and I will show you how to set your lights. Okay, I have just set the key light and there is a triangle which makes the video uh, look more cinematic. The only thing that I have to do now uh, to set a fill light or a rim light to make a contrast between the background and me. Okay, so as you can see there is a little light uh, around my face. Okay, now I add some lights be uh, behind the lenses and the camera because it also makes the video looks better. And the last thing that you can do is add some color grade because it helps the color looks better, more saturated or less saturated. That's it, how you can make a cheap camera looks professional. 